In 1887, Heinrich Ertz observed that when ultraviolet light shines on two metal electrodes which had a voltage applied across them, the voltage at which the sparking takes place changes. This is the basis of the photoelectric effect which was further advanced and clarified by Philip Leonard in 1902. He discovered that when light struck a metal surface, it emitted particles which had an electrical charge on them. He further found out that these particles were electrons, which were earlier discovered by J.J. Thomson in 1897. Further experimentation and research revealed that the photoelectric effect is essentially an interaction between light and matter that couldn't be explained by classical physics, which thought of light as a wave. Another mystery behind this phenomenon is that there is virtually no time delay between the striking of the metal surface and the emission of the electron itself. These mysteries and unexpected results was what led way to the genius himself, Albert Einstein. In 1905, he proposed a radical new theory of light, where he considered light to be made up of particles, or to be specific, photons. He continued to explain that these photons contained a fixed amount of energy, or quantum, that depended on the light's frequency. He assumed that a photon would go through the metal surface and transfer its energy to the electron, which would allow it to escape the atom. Despite this ingenious theory, his photon hypothesis wasn't popular among the scientific community and wasn't universally accepted, until it got experimentally verified by 1916 by Robert Millikan. Einstein was finally awarded the Nobel Prize in Physics for, in 1921 for explaining the photoelectric effect. Essentially, in a sentence, the photoelectric effect is the emission of the electron when electromagnetic radiation, such as light, hits a metal surface.